As a new intern, you will be responsible for several patients' care. But of course, you can't be at the hospital at all times. Whether this is because you are going home from your shift or because you're starting a new rotation, you'll need to provide patient handoff each time. This is often referred to as either handover or sign out. As resident work hours are reduced, patient handoffs occur more and more frequently. Unfortunately, patient handoff is prone to miscommunication. In fact, communication errors during handoff leads to about 80% of serious medical errors. So it is very important that you have a structured and systematic way to perform a handoff. You will probably encounter different systems for handoff, but here is one mnemonic I find helpful, the five S's. This provides a framework for handoff and stands for severity, story, steps, situation, and say it back. Studies have found that the use of a standardized handoff tool has decreased handoff-related errors. A study in the New England Journal of Medicine found that residents' use of a standardized handoff system resulted in a 23% relative reduction in the rate of overall medical errors across multiple sites. The rate of near misses also decreased by 21%. You might wonder if using a mnemonic like this increases the time it takes to perform patient handoff. This study showed that there was no change in the time spent completing handoffs and no decrease in the provider's contact time with patients and families. You may be expected to hand off patient care in both verbal and written format. In our next sections, we'll discuss each part of the 5S's handoff in depth with guidance for both verbal and written handoff. So I hope you liked this video. Absolutely make sure to check out the course this video was taken from and to register for a free trial account which will give you access to selected chapters of the course. If you want to learn how MetMastery can help you become a great clinician, make sure to watch the About MetMastery video. So thanks for watching and I hope to see you again soon.